for 12 month consecutive in last two years or get a employer preference it doesn't mean that we will accept your score one will be your employer and the second one will be the senior most person work country where you have taken your nursing degree in english Assalamu alaikum this is Dr Faraz Ahmed and I am again here for my nurses colleague you must be knowing that UK NMC has given almost 3 weeks back an update regarding the OET score and clubbing score of nurses but today UK NMC has again updated on their website regarding the employer reference because a lot of nurses colleague a lot of uh, nurses were emailing the UK NMC and they were repeatedly asking about the employer reference because in the previous decision uh, they haven't decided uh, for the employer reference so today uk nmc has uh, decided and uh, uk nmc has updated on their website regarding the employer reference definitely i will discuss about the employer reference to conditions for the employer reference to be acceptable and for how many month or how, uh, for how long you should be working here in the uk definitely we will talk about it but let me uh, briefly repeat for you people that previously 3 weeks back uk nmc has decreased the score of clubbing i am talking about the clubbing they have not decreased the score of which is required for the nurses they have decreased the score only for clubbing from 6.5 in the ielts to 6 only in the writing and they have decreased the score from c plus to c in the oet only in the writing i am not talking about the required score required score is still 7 uh, in each and 6.5 in writing and b in all the module and c plus in the writing so required score is still the same so what they have done today they have updated on their website regarding the employer reference uh, because a lot of people were requesting them so today they has decided that to get a employer reference you should be working in the united kingdom in any of the setting like you should be working in social uh, social settings or you should be working in a healthcare setting okay so you should be working in any of these two settings for at least at least 12 month you should be working here for at least at least 12 month in last two year like if someone was working 3 years back and he has worked here for 2 year and he is not working uh, for the last 3 years he is not applicable please make their, this point very clear in your mind that if you are working here for 12 month consecutive in last 2 years only you should be working here in last 2 years more than 12 month then you are eligible to get the employer reference this is very important and clear point but if you are working here for the last 12 month although you are eligible but still there are two more conditions what are these conditions so the first condition is that uh, your ielts or oet score should not be less than 0.5 in the ielts or half grade in oet what does it mean let me clear for you like you have given your ielts previously and you got a uh, 6 in the writing so definitely you were not eligible but if you want to get the reference from the employer okay so your ielts score should be less than 0.5 band like your required score in the ielts was 6.5 and you scored 6 so definitely you are eligible to get the reference from employer and let's talk about uh, reading listening and speaking the required band is 6 uh, required band is 7 So if you scored 6.5 previously and you are working here for 12 month in uh, in the United Kingdom so definitely you are eligible to take the uh, you know reference from your employer the other thing let's talk about the OET if you are working here for the last 12 month and your score in the writing was C required uh, uh, grade in the OET is C plus but your grade was C so definitely you are eligible for the employer reference same is the case with rest of the sub test of OET required score was B if you you got C plus previously so you are eligible for the employer reference so this is the first condition and what is the second condition so, so the second condition if you are working here for at least 12 month the second condition is that you must be from a country where you have studied your nursing degree in english 
because there are few countries like China uh, or some uh, Arabic country where they teach their doctors and nurses in their native languages. If you are from this type of country, you are not eligible for employer reference. To get the employer reference, you must be from a country where you studied your nursing in English. So these two conditions are very necessary along with this recommendation. So the other important point is that UKNMC will give you a form on their website. You will download this form and you will take this form to your employer. So your employer will have to fill that form. Your employer will not give you in a written on any page or on any, any pad or on any of the official page, no. Your employer will have to fill the form taken from the UKNMC website. And two people will sign this uh, form. The one will be your employer and the second one will be the senior most person working under your employer. Number one is employer and second one is senior most person working under your employer. So these two people will sign the form for you. Uh, they will sign, yes, you are eligible, your English is good. They will sign the form. All right. And the other thing is that both of your employer and senior most person working under the employer should be registered with UKNMC. So now they will sign and you will send the form to the UKNMC. So it is clearly written on the UKNMC website that it doesn't mean that we will accept your score. UKNMC still have right uh, not to accept your application. It is clearly written on their website. So the last point people were asking, people were asking repeatedly to UKNMC, please make the changes as early as possible. UKNMC has previously decided that we will make the changes applicable in January 2023, but people will saying that please make them applicable in late December or in the late November. Today UKNMC has clearly said that we are not going to take any decision in such a haphazard manner. We are not in any hurry. They have uh, clearly uh, said on their website that we are thinking on it and we will definitely make it applicable in January 2023 and uh, they have not given the date yet. They will give date in near future. Uh, if you want to know about the date, please keep visiting UKNMC website and definitely when this news will come, we will also share on our channel as well.